everybody, Spencer here. Welcome to the Conjecture Criticism Network. I'm excited to talk to you guys today about a special announcement. So as many of you have already seen from a Reddit post, from Facebook posts, uh, we have an exciting thing happening to Conjecture Criticism, and I wanted to make a video about it to kind of clear up some of the confusion that I found around the original posts. So and that, with that being said, the announcement is that John Stern and Seth Manfield will be joining Constructive Criticism as the regular hosts of the show along with me. So the first question... That we people have been giving me are who are these people? Uh, if you don't know, John Stern and Seth Manfield are longtime matches at the Gathering Pros. Seth Manfield uh, is, I think, the number one rated player right now, tied with Louis uh, Salvato. Uh, they'll be having a playoff for Player of the Year coming soon. John Stern is a longtime Canadian pro, uh, and he was actually on the podcast a few weeks ago. And what people don't know is that John was actually on the podcast so that I could see how much I liked working with John and if I thought he would be a good fit for the show. Um, I, I've known that this change was coming for a long time. Uh, and I, and myself and Michael talked about who we thought could fill that role really well. And we both were really excited about John. John suggested Seth, um, as a, another partner in this, Seth said yes. And we've gone ahead and moved forward with that. So we're really excited to bring the perspective of longtime professional magic the gathering players to constructive criticism to help players improve at the game. And it's, it's a dream come true for me. So we're really excited about that. Um, so the first thing that people ask, uh, other than that, is, are these going to be your regular hosts? Absolutely. Um, John and Seth will be on every single week. Uh, they will be starting after Pro Tour Guilds of Ravnica, and they'll yeah, the show will be f free for listeners. Uh, you just go to Constructor Criticism and download the show. It's going to be super awesome. Their first episode, however, will be Patreon only for patrons of $10 or more per month. This is for a couple of reasons. The first one is we wanted to reward our longtime patrons that have made it possible for us to get Seth and John onto the show. It means a lot to me to have uh, the ability to get such amazing players and, and be in these conversations with them. And I wanted to reward our patrons who have who have supported us. So, um, you know, I've let our patrons know if you are a patron already, you can just go ahead and, and you want to listen to that episode, just go ahead and, and change your monthly donation. Uh, the for, for the the first one's ten dollars. Um, that could change. Uh, there's we're not locked in on anything, but there will be a pro tour exclusive episode for patrons only every single pro tour. And the plan is to do two separate tags, so or two separate uh, parts. One of them will be with John Stern, where we talk about John's testing and how he ended what he deck he ended up on and how he got there and what he thinks the tournament will be like. And we'll do the same thing with Seth, and we'll have them separately so that you can get both sides. Um, from from two different pros on different teams on and different testing situations and kind of understand where their head is at going into the Pro Tour. And that episode will be published on patreon.com slash ccmtg the Saturday of the Pro Tour. So that's really exciting stuff. We're really excited about it. So the next questions we get are about Michael and Matt. Um, and like I kind of hinted at, I've actually known this was going to happen for a while. Um, actually, bringing Matt on the show was part of the, part of the reason for bringing Matt on the show originally was because I was pretty sure I was going to lose Michael. And, uh, you know, I think that Matt and Michael turned out to just be a dynamic duo that I really loved having on the show. It was, it was amazing to have them bounce off each other. I learned a lot about going back into a three-man podcast and how to do it better. You know, something that I really struggled with early on in podcasting was fulfilling a host role and allowing my, my co-host to, to lift the show up. Um, and I think I've gotten better at that, and I'm really excited to do that with John and Seth. But Matt was just amazing in the last couple of months of constructive criticism. Um, but Matt is going to be taking a break from Magic. Matt's Matt's not going to be playing the game as much. And uh, so I, I knew Matt was going to leave. And then Michael is looking into getting other jobs that would not allow him to play Magic the Gathering anymore. And he's been doing that for a while. And, uh, you know, knowing that, you know, Michael was leaving and Matt was leaving, you know, we had tons of conversations around what this means to the show, how long they could do it for, when they expected things to change, things like that. And so when they when they heard about who uh, we were looking at, you know, they they wanted those guys to start right away. Um, you know, they thought it'd be best for the show. And so even though Michael doesn't have that job yet, Matt hasn't quite quit Magic yet. You know, we're gonna move ahead in November with the switch, knowing that long term these guys weren't gonna stay. So you know, some of the other frequently asked questions that we get are. Will the podcast still be free? Absolutely. Go to ConstructorCriticism.com, download the episode. Every week, the regular episode will be free for everyone to listen to. We're really excited about bringing that content to the world uh, from some of the greatest minds in magic. Uh, will the Patreon change? Yeah, actually it will. Um, there, We're in discussions about how we want to do the Patreon. The Patreon has been needing to change for a long time. 
Uh, there's lots of things that when we started that don't work, don't people don't like. It's not actually that helpful. It's not that cool. And we want to change things so people are getting real value uh, when they're donating. And and that's important to us, you know. Whether it's uh, you know, t I, I actually don't want to say some of the things that are being talked about, but that we're talking about stuff that's going to be valuable to the listeners. Um, when you have somebody like Seth and somebody like John, you can do different things, and we're really excited about it. So, um, so you know, stay tuned for put Patreon changes that are coming. Um, is Spencer still hosting is another question we've gotten. Yes, I actually will still be the host of the show. I don't plan on going anywhere. My magic life has changed a lot since I became a father. And right now my focus is on the content. My focus is on making great content. And having Seth and John here to help me out on that is going to be a big deal. And I'm really excited about it. So I'll, I'll still be the host every week. And we'll we'll keep this going. Um, so another question I've gotten, are you, Matt, and Michael fighting? Uh, no, these guys are my best friends. I love them more than anything in the world. And I promise that nobody's sadder to see them go than me. Uh, you know, I, I, I love these guys. Uh, I might cry. I, I legitimately love them. I hope that they legitimately love me. They tell me they do. But it's it's tough. It's I did the show with Matt and Casey and Kyle, episode one, which is my friends. I want to do a podcast about something that would help me improve the game while doing it and help others improve the game because that's what important to me. I want to help players get better at Magic the Gathering, and, and this was an avenue for us to do it. And, you know, five years later, we're still doing it. And lots of people have told me about winning PPQs, qualifying for their first Pro Tours, competing their first GPs. And now the podcast has helped them. And having Seth and John join the show just allows more of that. You know, there's there's deeper knowledge than what Matt, Michael, and I have to offer. And we joke all the time that we're really bad at magic. And the reason that we say that, you know, while all of us are in that the top 1% of players in the world, it's not the same thing as being John and Seth when you're in the top 0.1% of players in the world. Um, you know, probably better than that. It, it's it's a whole nother level that when you watch them play and when you talk to them, is if you listen to the John episode, you get something very different and something real and something tangible that's, that's so much stronger than anything that I could ever offer our listeners. And I'm really excited about that. Um, so to answer the question, no, Matt and I uh, are still like best friends. And Michael's still one of my best friends, too. There's no fighting. There's no drama. Uh, they're not quitting because they don't like me. I'm not fighting them because I don't like them. It's it's nothing like that. Sorry, there's no drama. Uh, they'll be on the episodes for the next four weeks anyway. So um, so how long is this for? This is for the foreseeable future. Um, we're hoping to just keep this going for as long as, as Seth and John want to do it. And, and we're really excited about it. Hopefully we can make this something that they really enjoy doing, that our listener base can grow, our community can grow, and it can be a part of their lives. So that's that's all the frequent questions. If you have any questions that I didn't answer in this video, please leave a comment. I'll be I'll make sure to answer them. We're really, really excited about the changes. We're really excited about Seth. We're really excited about John. And we're sad to see Michael and Matt go. But you know, all of this is going to be for the good of the listeners and for the good you know, for the good of the magic community. We want to help people improve the game and this gives us a really good chance to do it. So Thank you, everybody, for watching. Don't forget to go to patreon.com slash ccmtg if you want to hear that first episode. Donate $10 a month. And we'll see you guys all next week with another episode of Constructor Criticism where you can hear from Matt Michael. So thanks, everybody. See you guys all next episode.